like a Big Mac. Cheers. I think there's only one way to do it. Hey everyone, welcome to the Joel Hans Show. You know that show where we eat way too much food at excellent restaurants and excellent places. Well, today I'm back at Cause and Effect. It's been a long time since I've been here. Last time we ate lots of seafood, lots of steak, and today we're doing nothing but that. I have some lovely tenderloins, I got lovely salmon, I got calamari, I got even some poke, I got other items as well. Favorite last time, we had Big Mac tacos, I got breakfast tacos this time, I got shrimp, I got everything, even a couple breakfast items. So basically we're gonna have a hell of a feast. Let's dig on in, let's have some fun. And of course, let's eat some food. All right, so there's so many different items here. Like there's literally just countless areas to start. But uh, I think very suiting as per last time. I think I started with a Big Mac taco. I'm gonna start with one as well. So basically a taco, like a Big Mac. Cheers, I think there's only one way to do it. Just like I remember, literally it's just like a Big Mac. It's like a bun, lettuce, tomato, cheese, Big Mac sauce, meat. And I'm no complaints, although, you gotta get some steak and seafood, because that's what we're here for today. But we might as well get rid of this last one here. Delicious. What can I say? Alright, so so far we have had a whole three bites of this meal. You know what? Let's go with this salmon. I don't think salmon is ever supposed to really be eaten with your hands, but I'm going to. So I love this guy. He's got maple Dijon batter or like a sauce on it. Pistachio and pinko crust it. We have the skin on it, which is really nice. Nice crunch, crisp. I remember it being good, and it is definitely very good. No complaints. In fact, that was very, very delicious. I really like that sound. Got some salads. Got a house salad, I got a calamari. Calamari, calamari, a Caesar salad, that's what I meant to say. Delicious. I'll put that Caesar right there, got rid of this plate. That way, 
I can put these lovely looking steaks towards me. So I actually have two. We have two nine ounce tender ones here. I'm a big steak fan. I love steak, in fact. Beef. Beef, y'all. Beef. Served in a lovely reduction. Looking mighty tasty. That sauce it's in, it's buttery. It's like a red wine reduction. So soft though, just so tender. Tenderloin or filet is most notably known for being tender. It's a leaner steak. Mm. But oh so good. Just something about beef. Something about cows. Cows are delicious. They are made to be eaten. Muy bien, very, very good. Really nice size on the steak, too. Try some of these mashed potatoes. I remember those mashed potatoes being very good, and they are very, very good. Have some asparagus. How about them healthy vegetables? I like that they grill the asparagus. Very nice tasting. No complaints. Really nice garlic in the mashed potatoes. And that was so buttery. Very, very good. I'm gonna make sure I get through the rest of this food, so I'm gonna leave a little bit of mashed potatoes. Maybe we'll come back to it. All right. Got so many options here still. Got breakfast, the calamari, got poke, got some shrimp. Oh, this is an interesting dish. Got some cheesy, cheesy shrimp, y'all. Cheesy shrimp. Shrimp covered in cheese. This one is a, it's in a garlic butter as well. They gave me a garlic bread as well. Try it out. <laughs> Garlic, rich. <laughs> That's very good.
Honestly, I just realized I ate all of them. Whoops. They didn't get through all the bread. But this shrimp, very good. Very buttery. Garlic. Fantastic. These breakfast tacos look cool though. But I'm gonna wait for breakfast. We can go for this delicious looking calamari. Remember have this last time. It'll be fantastic. Crispy, crunchy. There's a little bit of like chili on there. Lovely aioli. Another fun one. We have a hot dog. Fiesta dog. Not what I would have expected. What I love is that when I get to go to restaurants like this, I get to try items that I normally wouldn't. Just like a hot dog. I normally wouldn't be trying a hot dog, but here I get to try a hot dog. Pretty cool. It looks really good. Love the calamari. Actually, cooked perfectly. Nice and crispy. No complaints. Next, let's go with this poke bowl. I love poke. I remember being really well. Ahi tuna on it. Love tuna. Avocado, sesame, all the fresh stuff. They have some pickled onions in there. Fantastic. The dressing, the sauce they put on it. Sesame. No doubt, this is actually one of my favorite and like best. Yeah, I think this is, I put go as far to say this is one of my favorite Pokeballs I've ever had. Just love the sauce about it. It tastes so fresh, that tuna's great. Sauce just fantastic. Sesame, ginger, delicious. Poke. Go over this lovely Caesar salad I still have. And I remember it being very delicious. So let's find out. Bacon, very heavy pepper crunch taste, but I really like that. Very creamy. Good Caesar, heavy pepper crunch. All right, so now we're down to breakfast. And the Fiesta Dog. So I think let's try, I'm gonna try the Fiesta Dog. This is very interesting. That's sour cream. We got some nacho inspired isms here. We got some cheese sauce. Apparently it's a very popular item. So I'm very intrigued to see what a Fiesta Dog is like. But I'm ready for a Fiesta. Mm. 
Wow. I did not expect that. Okay, the hot dog itself is super, super beefy, super delicious. That sour cream, that cheese, it actually goes really, really well. It's, it's really impressive. Whatever hot dog they're using though, delicious. Very delicious, very beefy. And then there were two. So generally, you'd eat breakfast first. Well today we're eating breakfast last. So breakfast burger, breakfast tacos. This is really cool. This is actually made with hash browns. This is a hash brown tortilla, basically. Sour cream, eggs, bacon, cheese, hollandaise sauce on this burger as well. Pat, sausage patties, eggs, etc. So that sounds delicious. That's actually really, really good. So the egg's really good. The cheese, we got creamy. Got a nice, really rich fried aspect with a nice crunch from the tortilla, the hash browns itself. Really cool. I did. The freaky thing is that I basically just fit that whole thing in my mouth. That's pretty crazy. Sometimes my mouth scares me. Last one. Of our lovely breakfast tacos. Like I said, great crunch on them. Alright, then last but definitely not least, breakfast burger. Sausage patties, fried egg, cheese, hollandaise sauce, love hollandaise sauce, and hash browns. Ooh, bacon too. Yes, look at that. Beautiful. Muy bien. Gooey yolk, nice richness from that patty, that sausage patty, really cured flavor, 
Bacon's good, nice thick cut. Really, 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 really. You mommy mouthfeel given by that holiday sauce. To do breakfast. Charlie's hash brown. Say we tried one. But the last time, what I really remember, it was absolutely excellent and phenomenal, was dessert. They had funnel cake fries. Funnel cake fries. If you don't know, I love fried dough. And I love fried dough covered in sugar and sweetness and everything in between. So we're definitely gonna have to get some dessert. I even had some cheesecake, I think, last time. I had so much stuff, just like jaw dropping. So I definitely gotta save room for dessert. Because that is delicious. Hash brown. No complaints. All right, so seriously, some good food though. Really enjoyed that. I really like the steaks, the steaks, the tenderloins are fantastic, great cuts, very, very nice item. That salmon's really, really good. Calamari's is definitely as good as I remember, which is excellent. The Big Mac tacos were freaking excellent. Oh, the poke bowl, poke bowl actually was fantastic. Like I said, I think one of my favorite poke bowls of all time, if not my favorite. Just whatever that sauce they put on there, that sesame ginger, just beautiful. Well, that's pretty much, oh, the garlic shrimp is good too. So that, let's say round one. Now let's go get some dessert, and we'll have to come back with that action here momentarily. All right, dessert, look at this. My absolute favorite from last time, we have funnel cake fries. We're talking warm fried dough ice cream, Oreo cookie bits, sauces, whipped cream. Just look at that. Even better, look at this. Reese's, Reese's peanut butter, Reese's cups, Reese's pieces, chocolate, drizzle, funnel cake fries, and pita. Can we get a moment of silence for Reese? Oh my gosh, so good. And then, cheesecake, no complaints. Oh my God. I just, I can't. That was, let's just dive right in. Start with the funnel cake fries, my favorite from last time. Oh boy, sweet, salty, warm, savory. It's too good. It's just too good. Mm. That ice cream. On that warm fried dough. So gushy, so sweet, so delicious. Words cannot describe. I'm sorry.
I literally have nothing to say. Wow. 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 Like literally, there's just like, usually I have something to say, I literally have nothing. The funnel cake fries have officially broke me. I am broken with these funnel fries. It is just like so, you get that rich, creamy fried, like everything. Rich, warm fried dough, creamy ice cream, whipped cream, ice cream, syrups. I literally think this might be one of my favorite. This is definitely one of my favorite desserts of all time. People ask me that. And undoubtedly, it is just too good. These funnel cake fries are just an absolute must. I don't know how something could be so amazing. It's just too good. Mm. I literally don't know where you can go from there. It is just like, it just gets better. Okay. Basically funnel cake fries with fried pitas, but this time Reese, Reese's pieces, guys. Look at that Reese cup, that is a whole nice half, is dripping. That is a whole nice big drippy Reese cup. Let's try this thing out. That's cool, with the fried pita and little bits of Reese's pieces. Oh. Oh my gosh. That peanut butter adds such a nice creaminess, a richness. Mm. A lot more cinnamon in these ones. Look at that. Look at those little sprinkles. Cinnamon. Reese's Pieces, hot damn. It's a good bite, got a Reese cup, fried dough. So much peanut butter. And you can never have enough peanut butter. So good. You know, it'll be a great dish in this. Ice cream. Mark my words, I'm gonna be back. I'm gonna get this with ice cream. So good though. Chocolate, peanut butter, boy oh boy. Just look at this. I just can't get over that. It's so gooey. Sticky, warm, soft. I think I'm still describing funnel cake fries. Yes I am. Did I mention I love to just dive right into this thing right here? So good. And last but not least, the extra cheesecake. Grab my drink. Tyco. Gotta keep the calories down somewhere.
Caramel, chocolate, cheesecake. That's about it. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Well, everybody, now my visit to cause and effect is definitely complete. There is a cause, and there is an effect. The cause ate extremely delicious food and an excellent experience. The effect, I'm in heavenly bliss. Hell right. So definitely would recommend cause and effect. Really love the place here. The people are great. The place is bumping on like the week, on like nights times. They got music sometimes. DJs, they have an excellent looking patio. They have crazy cocktails that foam and bubble and change colors. It's such, it's like it's like an experience in itself. It's like an experience, an excellent one, and a dining experience as well. Being specifically, this funnel cake, these funnel cake rides, I would travel like I would travel miles and miles for them. They are fantastic, so dang good. This freaking Reese nachos was absolutely delicious as well. Loved that. Throw some ice cream on that. You got funnel cake fries basically with Reese. So good. Cheesecake was fantastic. I already spoke of the other items earlier, but I absolutely love the steak, the poke bowl. That's just it. We pretty much ate everything, and everything was fantastic. So that everybody, hope you enjoyed today. I know I sure did. It was very good. So that, of course, everybody, till next time. Stay happy, stay healthy, stay hungry. Don't eat as much as I do. Definitely get yourself some good food. Come on by, try to cause and effect. And with that, everybody, until next time, of course. Happy eating. Just wanted to pop in, everybody. First, say, you are awesome. Thank you so much for watching. Also, I just wanted to mention, we have such a beautiful, large family here on YouTube, but much smaller families on Facebook and Instagram. So be sure to check out the links in the description to follow me on those things as well. That way you never miss a beat and you get the most content possible. Dang nabbit cat, you're gonna be down the menu next week if you don't shut up. So everybody, thanks so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed. Click my face right here to subscribe. And also I picked two videos. That's right, two videos just for you that you might like. Right here. So like I said guys, hit that subscribe, hit one of these videos, do it right now. Until next time, have a lovely day. <laughs>